Triggertron is yet another rarity device, which is still being used nowadays. The word trigger forms the basis of the word, thus meaning a starting device, a startup signal, and an electron. Triggertron is a variety of a triggered spark gap switch with a cold cathode. It is used for controlling high voltages and currents. Usually this is 10-100 kV, 20-100 kA and up to mega amperes. The term Triggertron was actually not used anymore in the 1970s, being replaced by a wider term Trigger Tube. A Triggertron has three electrodes, two massive main electrodes for passing the current and a small control electrode. When the Triggertron is switched off, the voltage between main electrodes must not exceed breakdown voltage, which is the distance between electrodes and a dielectric used. Air, argon, oxygen mixture, nitrogen, hydrogen or insulating gas can be used as dielectrics. A control electrode is often located in the cavity in the center of the main positive electrode, anode. A negative electrode, that is cathode, does not have any apertures. Electrodes heat up strongly as they are affected by an electric arc. This leads to a gradual evaporation of the electrode material. Certain Triggertron designs can regulate distance between electrodes or replace them completely. Main electrodes are usually made of bronze or copper tungsten alloys. A Triggertron is turned on by supplying a high voltage pulse to the control electrode. The pulse ionizes gas between control and main electrodes. A spark discharge occurs. It reduces a non-ionized gap between main electrodes. The spark creates ultraviolet radiation and generates numerous free electrons in the gap. This quickly results into electric breakdown. An electric arc of small resistance appears between main electrodes. The arc continues unless the voltage between main electrodes reaches a certain value. Triggertron designs are very simple. Very often using them is the cheapest solution for supplying powerful electric circuits. Triggertrons may be caseless and function in the open air. They may have a sealed glass or ceramic case filled with dielectric gas, also under pressure. The case may also be filled with a liquid dielectric, for example with a mineral oil used for increasing operating pressure. There are multiple-use Triggertrons, designed for over 10,000 switching operations, and disposable Triggertrons, which collapse on their first switching. That is why glass Triggertrons are often covered with a protective corrugated metal gauze. In this way, glass pieces are not scattered when the bulb ruptures. Triggertrons are used in pulse engineering. For example, they were used in modulators of the first radars for transmitting powerful pulses to magnetrons. Nowadays, Triggertrons are used for controlling electric detonators. They also serve as discharge arresters in MUX generators or Tesla coils.